Now, in this video, we are going to take up one more problem on the projections of points. The point problem reads as a point capital P is on HP and 35 mm in front of VP. Another point capital Q is on VP and below HP. The line joining the red front views makes an angle of 30 degree with the XY line, while the line joining the top views makes an angle of 45 degree with the XY line. Find the distance of Q from HP. So this is the problem which is given. So here what we can do directly we can start uh, solving this problem because we need not have to solve by using the three dimensional drawing because we have come to a stage wherein we will be able to analyze the problem uh, just by considering the orthographic view. So when he says that point P is on HP obviously it should be on XY line but whether to identify the front view or top view. If it is on HP so obviously the image will be on VP so it is the front view. So P dash will going to be the front view and 35 in, in, in 35 mm in front of VP. In front of VP is always comes below XY line because when you are considering the first quadrant and where you are going to get the in front of VP. In front of VP we will going to get it in first quadrant as well as in the uh, uh, fourth quadrant. So in if you consider this in front of VP is in HP. So this is uh, top view and uh, this is front in first okay now this is first quadrant and also in the fourth quadrant you will go to get both front view and top view in the below s line so as the top view in front of vp as the top view is below x y line so from here you measure uh, 35 mm in front of vp and you mark this point so this will go to be p Another point Q is on VP. So in on VP means it will be on HP. So obviously the image will be the top view. So you have Q on HP. We don't know where exactly it will go to come and meet. And below HP. Below HP means always it is in the uh, fourth quadrant because the below HP means it will be on VP. So the front view will be below HP. So even if you consider the third quadrant, again you have the front view which is below HP. So this is the third quadrant. So both in the third and fourth you are going to get below HP. So the front view will be below X by line. So from here you want to draw this. But how to identify that? But we know the line joining the front views makes an angle of 30 degrees to the X by line. So what you can do is you draw a line from the front view because the front view is here. So you draw a line in kind of 30 degrees to X by line below the X by line because front view will comes below x y line and by line joining the top views makes an angle of 45 degree with the x y line. So what you can do from P, you have fixed the both front view and top view of the point P. So from here when you draw a 45 degree line, it will going to cut the x y line at this point. So since the line joining the top views makes an angle of 45, so Q is on VP, obviously the top view will be on x y line. So you get Q. And as we have drawn this 30 degree line, it goes indefinitely. From Q, you draw a vertical projector which will go and cut this 30 degree line here and you mark this point as Q dash. As we don't know what is the distance we need to find out. So then from uh, uh, then by using the scale, you measure the distance which will going to be 20 mm. So you just measure 20 mm. Uh, uh, using the scale, you measure this length and you write it will be equal to 20 mm. When you are doing it in computer, you will be able to get the 20.21 mm. So this is how you will be able to analyze and draw this by using the sketchbook. Thank you.